Congrats on taking your light and power outside and off grid with the BioLite NanoGrid. This video will take you through the key components of the system and offer some helpful tips on setup and operation. If you want to skip around, the video is divided into three key sections, lantern overview, site light overview, and setup tips. Okay, let's get started. The BioLite NanoGrid has three lanterns that anchor the system, the PowerLite Mini, PowerLite, and Base Lantern. Pro tip, Base Lantern is also available in an XL model for more power. All three lanterns are USB rechargeable via micro USB, and all feature BioLite edge lighting technology, offering bright, even light across a compact, packable form. All lanterns come in demo mode to show you their lighting capabilities. Before we get started, let's exit that mode. For PowerLite Mini or Base Lantern, press and hold for five seconds. You'll see a flash and you're good to go. For the PowerLite, press the two outer buttons and hold for five seconds. On the flip side, let's say you push the button and it flashes, but then nothing happens. That means your light is locked. That's a feature that keeps your light from accidentally turning on in your bag and losing all its juice. Press and hold for five seconds and it will flash to show it's unlocked. If you want to lock it, press and hold for five seconds and it'll flash again. The PowerLite Mini is a great everyday light that works as both a wearable lantern or a bike light. It's got five modes you can switch through by clicking the top button rapidly. White, white point light, red night vision, white strobe, and red strobe. If you pass the mode you want, just keep clicking till you get back to it. When you're in white mode, you can press and hold to dim. To wear it, push the clip where there's tension and slide it into your pocket. To use it as a stand, rotate it outwards. Pro tip, bring a carabiner with you and hang your mini as a tent light. The PowerLight Mini comes with an easy to install bike mount. All you need is a screwdriver. Use the included pads to fit the diameter of your bike and just attach with a screw and bolt. That's it. The Mini's clip secures it into place. Strobe modes make it perfect for a front or tail light and the easy release means you won't forget to take it with you. Here on the side, you'll find the USB out where you can offer a backup boost to your phone. Really good for the weekdays if you're on the go. You can charge without the light on, just press the button on and off to activate power out. When your battery goes below 10%, it'll stop offering charge out and go into low power mode, so you still have some light available. Recharge it anytime via micro USB. The power light is a great combo of a flashlight, lantern, and USB power bank. The power light's interface has four buttons, lantern on, flashlight on, sight lights on, and a quick light button that you can use to turn the system on easily if you're fumbling in the dark. Or it can lock the power light when you're in transit. The back side is where you can recharge via micro USB and plug in your sight lights. All modes are dimmable, just press and hold. In lantern mode, you can push twice to only activate a single panel. It's a great way to conserve energy if you need a specific area lit. Pro tip, turn the flashlight mode on along with a single panel of the lantern. This is a great setup for when you're hiking late at night because it gives you light in front and light underfoot, so you don't trip on any unexpected roots or holes. The USB port on the side offers charge out to devices. With the internal 4400 milliamp battery, you can charge up to two phones depending on the model. If the battery goes below 10%, that last LED will begin to flash and it'll put the power light in low power mode, cutting off charge out and putting your light in a dim mode to conserve energy. The included wire stand can be used to hang it like a bulb or support it off a bottle like a task light. The S-hook also makes it easily hangable on any closed loops you might find on a tarp or a tent. New in 2017, we've got the BioLite Base Lantern. This 500 lumen flat pack lantern is a great hub for group camping and offers a ton of features that you can unlock from our first ever Bluetooth app. Before we get into the app, let's go over everything you can do manually. The top button turns your light on and you can cycle through three modes by pressing rapidly. On the last mode, if you press and hold, you'll move through a whole spectrum of colors. It's great if you're looking for a little mood lighting beyond white light. When you press and hold on white lantern mode, it'll dim up or down according to your needs. Lastly, this button also activates charge out. There's two USB ports on the side of your base lantern that you can use to charge gear. You can charge without the lantern on, just press twice. The amount you can charge depends on your model. The regular base lantern has an internal 7800 milliamp battery and the XL has a 12,000 milliamp battery. As with all of our lanterns, if it gets below 10%, it'll stop offering charge out and go into low power mode to conserve light. 
On the other side of the USBs, you'll find two sight light ports for our string light system, allowing you to hang your lights in different directions, making this a really effective hub. The sight light button on the side activates the string lights, which can be powered even when the base lantern light isn't on. When you press and hold, the sight lights dim up and down. Lastly, the folding legs on the base lantern make it easy to get your light up off the table, or you can hang or angle it for a task light. With the Base Lantern Bluetooth app, you can do all of these functions and more right from the palm of your hand. A quick thing to mention, our Bluetooth is Bluetooth LE, meaning low energy, so it draws very little power from both your phone and the Base Lantern. We've got a separate in-depth video about our app, which you should check out, so in this video, we'll just do a quick overview of the home screen. The main wheel is where you can turn on, off, and dim. Below it, you can control the warmth of your light or access color modes. Below that are lantern effects that can cycle through those color modes automatically. To the right, sight lights will appear if you've got those plugged in, and you can control those both individually or as a connected system with the base lantern. The upper left corner houses features like timers, alarms, and proximity activation. This uses your Bluetooth connection status to automatically turn on or off based on your location. This really comes in handy when you're hiking back a little bit later than you expected, like an instant beacon. Up at the top is where you get feedback on what's going on. It'll show you your connection status, if you're charging, and display real-time battery life so you know how much juice you have left. If you're looking to conserve your energy, you can do things like dim, disconnect lights or devices, and the dashboard will recalibrate to let you know how much light you've got left. All right, so we've talked through our three lanterns, let's talk sight lights. The Sight Light series comes in three models, Mini, Regular, and XL. When connected to the Power Light or Base Lantern, your sight lights are dimmable. If you want to power them from another source, we got you covered. All sight lights come with an included USB adapter, so you can plug into a portable battery or other USB power source. The sight lights are daisy chainable and can all work together seamlessly so you can mix and match according to your needs. Pro tip, make sure everything is plugged in securely before you start hanging stuff. If your sight light isn't working, push the connector firmly into the port. Sight Light Mini is a great quick setup with 150 lumens pre-strung with four T-like lights. The Mini can create perimeters to your sight, offer festive lighting, or help guide people to recommended footways. The Sight Light Regulars are a great way to create spotlights around your campsite. At 150 lumens each, they make excellent task lights for things like food preparation or reading. The XL is a fun way to bring a full moon to your site. With 300 lumens and 15 feet of cord, this fabric lantern pops open for instant ambient overhead light. All sight lights feature an ultra packable design. The minis stack on top of one another, the regulars clasp together to form a protective orb, and the XL packs down like a bounce or a laundry hamper. Just press, twist, and pack. One more time, press, twist, and pack. And now, here are some tips for some good setups. Tip number one, think about the jobs that need to get done around your site and how they'll be affected when the sun goes down. Things like wayfinding, tent setup, meal prep, and even just hanging out all rely on good lighting. Tip number two, get up off the ground. Biolights, hooks, and string lights enable you to create overhead lighting, which helps fight shadows and removes clutter from your campsite. Tip number three, looking to conserve energy? Gradually dim your lanterns and your eyes will adjust. You often don't need as many lumens as you think. Tip number four, looking to not worry about energy at all? Pair your nanogrid with a BioLite solar panel and create a truly self-sufficient system of light and power. Looking for more lighting inspiration? Visit the BioLite blog or our Instagram to see how BioLiters around the world are building their own nanogrids to bring energy everywhere. Check out our BioLite FAQ for more tips and answers on all things nanogrid. From all of us here at BioLite, thanks for watching.